My name is Lawrence Kagan. I was born on January the 24th, 1921. And I was born about, it was about 20 miles south of Terre Haute, Indiana, you know, on a farm. I moved into town and I lived there in Terre Haute for quite a while till I came to Indianapolis in 1939. I uh, got this job then with Lucas Harrell and they built parts of this Norton bomb site. And so uh, I went to work there and I was a, a supervisor of the training department. I had five uh, instructors that had about six trainees teaching them how to be a machinist and run machines. They, they told me one day that they couldn't get me any more deferments. So they called me in and said that if I wanted to get into a service, now would be the time to go and enlist because you'd be drafted. So I decided I didn't want to walk, so I got into the Navy in uh, 1943 and uh, as a machinist. And I was on a ship called the USS Nereus and we carried torpedoes and things like that for the uh, submarines. So we went to uh, on to Pearl Harbor right then is when we saw all those ships of land there that had just been bombed by the, the Japanese. And that was an awful sight to see. And we was there and then we left there and went to Sasebo, Japan. And when we got uh, there to Sasebo, we had 24 Jap submarines corralled in there. Our ship being the, the command ship we went on board of these here submarines and loaded a TNT on the bow and on the stern. Then after that was done, we made them take the submarines out into the ocean into a half moon circle. And we sent a demolition squad out from our ship and they set the timing off on these submarines and down they went. We sank the submarine that sank the Indianapolis to them. Then I was eligible for discharge. They went to Nagasaki, but they was gonna go to someplace else before they come home. And they said, if anybody wants to get off, that's eligible for discharge can get off. And we went back to Sasebo, but we went back on a train and through Nagasaki, I went through where they had dropped this atomic bomb and you never saw such a destruction in your life. Well, we cut the train and went back into Sasebo, Japan. We finally caught a ship going into the, back into the States. I went back to work with Lucas Harrell, but I decided that I wanted to start a business so I started a business, a machine shop, a tool and die company, a Keegan Tool and Die. And I was in business for 24, 25 years. My wife then had got sick and she passed away. And she, we had been married 60 years when she passed away. So I went to Emerson Avenue Baptist Church where uh, I met my wife now and uh, we've been married now four years, I go on four years. We finally come to Crestwood to live here and Crestwood is a wonderful place to live. The Veterans is a wonderful club they have. It's, it's uh, all veterans, I'm the uh, treasurer and my wife is the secretary and we have uh, entertainment, 
we have uh, dinners and things like that, but everything is going great there and having a wonderful time.